season. And Holiday with some good ball pressure on Marcus Smart. Off the handoff, it's Tatum back to Horford for three. Al Horford in the playoffs shooting 42% from downtown, and Giannis saying it with his chip. Remember, Lopez only played 13 regular season games because of that back injury. Smart from deep. Holiday. Holiday from deep. His shooting has been inconsistent. But There's an array of near 40% three-point shooters around at Tenacumpo. Horford off glass. Williams with the cleanup. Milwaukee elite protecting the rim, but there was rotation and he makes some pain. How about Drew? Mark Jones, two for two. Smart a 74%. It's a lot of the intangible things that add up to winning for Boston throughout. Oh, they so far off to a great start offensively for Milwaukee. Giannis dribbles into the pull, pull up and knocks it home. Well, from that point forward, they have been elite defensively. Jason Tatum had win, and I believe they have enough to win the championship, Mark. And Tatum, you talk about him, his leadership has been one of his growth areas this year as well. Holiday inside, blocked by Williams, and Lopez with the cleanup slam. And the Bucks, when they have, they are getting quality shots and making them. First lead of the ball game for Milwaukee. Tatum slips out on the screen, smart, sprays it out to Horford. Tatum and Giannis almost ended up in our lap here. Courtside, Celtics with possession. 12 on the shot clock for Tatum, guarded by Atenacumpo. They load up on Tatum, boxes and elbows. Williams with the follow, wow! Springy, Robert Wilching staff happy to have him back. And his health still improving. Derek White into the ball game now in the backboard for Boston. Nice cut by Smart, and the full game is good. So the Boston Celtics at NBATickets.com. Mark, Jalen and Jason have both been to, and yet Boston has the lead by seven. Mm. Points have been hard to come by so far for Tenacumpo and the Bucks until then. And that is in handle. The length of stride, the power to play through contact. And this guy is an absolute devastating force. And now that he's north of 70% free throw shooting, I don't know what you do with yeah. him. Can't put him on the line too much. Grant Williams has had an outstanding year shooting the three-pointer. Well north of 40% from downtown. One of the great stories this year for the Celtics. The lead is up to eight. A little side pick and roll with Portis, who has a mismatch, and now they switch back. Carter inside, blocked. Switchability. So your big gets switched onto a guard. And Al Horford says, Javon Carter, you got nothing inside the paint. Because I've got the lateral speed and the length to recover. Twice on the pipes, out of bounds. <laughs> no team in the NBA switches more statistically than the Boston Celtics. Connaughton laces a three. This is a homecoming for that young man who grew up about 12 minutes northeast of here in Arlington, Massachusetts. Actually won a state high school championship right on this floor. Horford sprays it out to Williams, another sidestep three. Oh, Jalen Brown, climb up! Portis with the silencer. Giannis has created the second most open threes. See the attention he's drawing. Beautiful find from the Greek freak. Lead is down to four. And Portis with the turnover. A two-on-one with Connaughton. Tries to do it himself and finishes. That's a big-time shot by Portis. So back-to-back -back buckets by Bobby. Gets Good. Milwaukee within two. We got a time out on the floor. The margin down to a tenuous two points. And Jalen...
Look at some of the cogent numbers so far. Milwaukee with seven turnovers already. And the Boston Celtics making them pay on the offensive glass. And eight pink points so far. A little full court pressure here by Milwaukee. Javon Carter is one of the best in the game at it. I just feel like their level of perimeter pressure has picked up down the stretch of this first quarter. Off the pin down, Tatum back out to Williams. Blocked by Lopez. Giannis missed the layup. A little off balance. Here's Tatum with the in and out dribble. Knocked out of bounds. It'll be Celtics basketball. You can see the presence of Brooke Lopez in the paint, though. They are so big and so long. And he is so good coming over at rotation. Grant Williams, you have yeah. to anticipate his presence being there. Playing on some fresh legs after missing all but 12 games during the regular season. A little bit of a bonus for the Bucks as B Carter with the open three. Got it. To me, this run by Milwaukee has been fueled by their defense, though. They've started to turn Boston over. Their pressure is higher. Their pickup point is higher. It's almost like Mike called that timeout and said, let's let's get busy on the defensive end. Tatum has been a little conspicuous by his silence so far. Peyton Pritchard from downtown. And one and done to the offensive end for Boston. Tenacupo up court. He's got six points. The Bucks in the midst of an 